We should be constantly given birth control. It should be annoying. Like when you leave a restaurant instead of mints, it should be birth control. <laughs> when you push a door instead of pull it, birth control should pop out. <laughs> like you're not ready yet. <laughs> Let's work on some other skills. <laughs> it's a human. You'd be making a human. It should be hard to make a human. It's hard to make a croissant. <laughs> it takes three days to make a croissant. You can make a human in that bathroom. You cannot make a croissant in that bathroom. <laughs> like, how many people here have successfully made a croissant? How many people here have accidentally made a human? <laughs> and those two people are never the same because croissant makers are planners. <laughs> And they're usually a little less fun. <laughs> now, when you had sex, you accidentally made a croissant. That would be great. <laughs> Finally, women would be like, no, I'm paying for the drinks and we're leaving now. <laughs> Drink it up, little lady. We're going home. I'm hungry and I want a flaky snack. <laughs> and finally, men would be like, I feel like you're just using me for the croissant. I mean, I don't care. I just want you to know how I feel. <laughs> and if having sex with a black guy meant you got a chocolate croissant, that never go back thing would be 100% true. <laughs> it should be hard. It should be hard to have a human. We have enough. We don't need as many as we used to. At this point, if you want to have a baby, you should have to take a test or two. Something simple. Like, let me see your iPhone screen. <laughs> oh, it's cracked? Then no. <laughs> you can't carry a phone, you can't carry a baby. <laughs> They're wigglier. <laughs> I don't want to have a baby or a family. I want a career. That's what I want. And I know there's a lot of people out there that are like, but Michelle, you don't have to choose. You can have it all. Women can have it all. Yeah, stop saying that. <laughs> you act like all is good. All does not mean good. You've never left an all-you-can-eat buffet and thought, I feel really good about myself. <laughs> mm. That crab and pudding is sitting really well together. I sure am glad I went back for spare ribs. Good. And even if we do try to have it all, even if a woman out there definitely wants it all, we've put up too many obstacles in your way to make it possible. It's like, oh, congratulations, you're having a baby? Great, couple things. We're gonna need you to get that car accident of a body back to work as soon as possible because this is America and we don't think you need time to recover. Also, you should breastfeed. It's what's best for the baby. But don't do it in public, you pig. Do it in the old janitor's closet underneath the bridge with the rest of the breastfeeding trolls. And don't have to take time off from work when your kids are sick. We'll think you're not dedicated. Also, why are you such a bad mom? By the way, your salary is just enough to cover the cost of childcare. And we know you're exhausted. You don't really know who you are anymore. You're trying to balance your old life and your new life. But quick, go have sex with your husband. He's about to leave. He doesn't understand what you're going through. Quick, go now. And sweetie, smile.